Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration reading for the Aries Sun, Moon and Rising sign for the second week of September. I want to say thank you for being here, thank you for being back, thank you for the wonderful positive energies. Um, please remember to listen to the Sun, Moon and Rising sign and thumbs up. There's a new series, the Full Moon series, and that Full Moon series is going to be um, it's all out. It is a series where you can receive extra information about what is going to happen for the full moon in the month with your zodiac sign. So you will be the fire sign. Okay, this week is a water week, and the zodiac energy is the hurt. Um, the fire week, and the zodiac energy is the hurt. And um, what happened is there is some balance and. Uh, um, with the balance that is coming in there is just wonderful energies of the balance okay so let's see what is happening the page of Pentacles is here um, the page of Pentacles for you Aries could be a message about um, a bill or that sort of a thing um, there's a transition that is coming in um, the Knight of Pentacles, this is someone who is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn on Wednesday, is in the reverse. Um, you have to find inner balance. You have to find balance within yourself. Whatever the situation is, you need to find balance within yourself. The King of Pentacles is here. Whoever this King of Pentacles is, um, it's um, is someone who is... Uh, Hey, um, Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn, and the energy of the Seven of Pentacles is here. It's all about money in this week. Whatever is happening, it's all about money in this week. Okay, so um, there is a, a situation for you, Aries, the Page of Pentacles, and the King of Pentacles. If this is your husband. Um, you know, whatever the situation is, if this is your husband, there is coming an end into whatever he used to um, give to you or give to the house or that sort of a thing. He's ending this for whatever reason it is, there is an ending. If it's someone that is always taking you for all what you have, this is coming for to an end. So if there was someone who was lying, cheating and that sort of a thing, um, and trying to extort you for um, money, um, whether it's Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, this is coming to an end. So let's see what is the page, because this week is from the 10th until the 16th, okay? Let's see what the page of Pentacles and the end, the debt, the transition, what is this saying? What is this saying? Um... The seven of swords whatever that was stolen um there was some um some as, as if you were billed over it's as if you have been um receiving bills that was extra that wasn't true okay as um it's as if you were receiving um um bills that wasn't that wasn't true people were deceiving you um, as as if um, people were um, sending you extra bill that wasn't true and now it's as if it is caught up on okay let's see um, what is the outcomes because whoever this person is, um, is um, I'm seeing this man for um, some of you husband and uh, um, there's an end that is going to be coming to um, his financial things art breaks art break Heartbreak. So, um, heartbreak. So, um, some of you are going to be having uh, heartbreaks uh, with this um, person. Um, is the end of a relationship, the end of a marriage. Um, that could bring the end of a relationship and the end of a marriage. Whatever the situation is, whatever that was transpiring, that could bring really an end into your relationship. Some heartbreaks that is coming up. All right, let's look and see what is the energy for the energy of the debt and um, the Knight of Pentacles. The debt and the Knight of Pentacles. Um, 
this is the energy of a transition with someone who is between the ages of 25 and 45 that is a um a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn okay um there could be that this person is passing away okay it could be that this person is passing away there's also the seven of Pentacles um, um, which is some sadness because the end of uh, the seven of Pentacles the end of um, you know waiting for what you have planted or what you have uh, um, work hard on um, if you're in a relationship with um, the Knight of Pentacles this is going to come to an end and um, it could be uh, some of you find out that you're pregnant and this relationship has come to an end um, some of you um, it, this is a, a transformation with the ending the death of a someone who is um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn okay the four of Pentacles is here um, which is um, you trying to hold on to what you have whatever the situation is is that you really really try to hold on on what you have um, basically you're trying to balance out your financial situation you're trying to figure out the best possible way for um, your financial situation to be balanced out okay so as we move forward um, we are looking at the knight of pentacles and temperance whoever this knight of pentacles is um, it's coming to an end okay something um, is coming to an end Wh whoever this person is whatever this person was doing this situation is coming to an end you have the energy of the two of ones and offer is going to be coming in for some of you um, a love offer this could be a love offer that is going to be coming in for some of you this could be um, that a, um, you will hear that um, either you're you're pregnant or a new child is coming in in your life okay there's an offer of love that is coming in for you and this offer of love could be coming from the knight of Pentacles uh, yeah so let's see what is the outcomes um, there is some worries for some of you um, this night could be passing away um, I see the night the tower um, and you need to find in a balance so this night could be passing away um, it is a situation where there is really some worrisome situation that is happening because whoever this night is it's as if it was your son and he was supporting you and um, there is a situation where he could be passing away or he has a new family now and that can't happen anymore that sort of a thing um, so um, whoever this person is um, you're seeing that you know the end of the situation and finally you're out of it so um, the king of Pentacles and the king of cups whoever these people are um, has to um, either if you're in business um, it could be that this king of Pentacles and this king of cups um, have um, a connection and whatever the situation is is that uh, the situation is going to um, end because of some money problem okay um, it could be your marriage is ending because um, your ex or someone told your husband to hand it because of this financial situation and this problem that is happening okay the four of Pentacles whatever the situation is is that you're trying to balance out your uh, financial situation then we have a lot of news coming to you a lot of news um, coming there's a lot of news um, that is coming to you um, the tower is at the end of a situation which is good whatever your worries was it's coming to an end and um, this news um, that is coming is with speed a lot of um, doors of opportunities um, could be opening also for you because I'm seeing the energy of the offer 
and your worries is going to be over the energy of the tower is here where um, whatever you were worried about um, it's going to come to an end now the eight of ones is uh, speed things are going just going to be happening with speed because you can see the energy of the tower things are just going to be happening with speed whoever the knight of Pentacles was that was affecting you in your life whether a friend a partner or a brother or um, someone on the work floor but this knight of Pentacles is is, is dying um, there is an ending that is coming to this knight of Pentacles whoever he is okay so there is really um, a sense of there is so much happening in this week and it's going to affect so many of you um, guys um, especially the people who are married to the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn there is going to be some heartbreaks and there is going to be some of you um, are going to be ending your marriage or um, your partner wants to end your marriage because of uh, um, financial um, instability okay um, the seven of swords oh that was the seven of swords some of you could realize that um, someone um, a older man someone a older man has taken some money um, from you okay and this could be a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn um the king of cups is here and the king of cups is um, going to try to help you to build a, a strong foundation and um, this is going to be in a positive way it's going to really help you to build a very strong foundation and it's going to be really in a healthy um, positive way okay in a very healthy and positive way so um, let's see what two messages are coming out for the Aries Sun Moon and Rising sign for this week oh, what messages um, there's an offer there's an offer that is about to come in okay so let's say that you guys were looking for something extra there is an offer that is about to come in and this offer is going to be very very positive okay alrighty let's see what's happening here you have the number five changes is happening changes is happening self work you need to find the self work within yourself you really need to find the self work within yourself this is a beautiful woman trying to love herself and learning to love herself again and as you do that you're going to be finding the self work um, within you and this is just going to be positive it's all about self worth in this month it's really really all about self worth in this month so um, there's a lot of endings um, transition that is coming in um, um, the king of um, the king a Pisces cancer a scorpion could be sending you messages um, there is a situation that I nearly come to an end um, and, and and this is good um, because the situation had to come to an end um, whatever you're wearing is it's, it's going to be over because it's the end it's as if there is uh, the end the transition the end of situation that is coming in okay and this is good and positive self word is the affirmation I am self worthy I am self worthy I am self worthy self word is going to be um, self word is really really um, going to be um, the name of the game in this week ladies and gentlemen I want to say to you how um, I've a wonderful week please remember to um, like share subscribe and we will talk next week